You know, I'm in a really good mood today. I mean, killer mood. Never done this before, but unless you're sleeping under a rock, you know that University of Alabama Crimson Tide won their fourth national championship Monday. Fourth national championship in seven years. So what I'm gonna do, since I've never done it before, is I got a special offer under the video for the Crimson Tide special for Hustlers Kung Fu full membership. Yep, I know, I know. Kind of crazy, but I was giddy. Because if you watch the game, which was a good game, it was back and forth, it was real tight. At one point it was a defensive battle and then it just kind of opened up after both defenses wore down. But I remember that one line. Clemson has never lost a game going, let's say, they were 51-0 going into the fourth quarter with a lead. And they went into the fourth quarter with a lead. And they kept it for about four minutes. And uh, it was on. It was on. It was on, Road Tide. It was on. And I, it's a good, the game was a good lesson in life. Because Clemson's going to be a force to be reckoned with next year. Number one, they're pissed off. I mean, they're, you know, it's... There's no shame in the way they played. They played their asses off. It was just straight up. They got out coached. That's the reason uh, Saban is the granddaddy. He out coached him. Two, not one, but two Heisman winners who were both running backs. This was it's a good moment in the Tide Nation. It's a great moment in the Tide Nation. If you saw the game, you know it was a defensive battle back and forth uh, real tight both defenses was you know running shit for a minute and then both teams were doing a little up team tempo Clemson was doing more but it was a good analogy for life because Clemson's going to be a force to be reckoned with next year because they got so close to the undefeated national championship they got so close and I would think the biggest variable was they got out coached the onside kick at that time score tied no one saw it coming I didn't see it coming Clemson surely didn't see it coming and that thing went it was a thing of beauty it totally changed the uh, momentum of the game totally changed the momentum so Hats off to Clemson for making it a wonderful championship game because you couldn't leave. You didn't know until like the last three minutes who won that game. It was like, well, you never know. The way they marched down the field, just that determination, that no quit, you gotta like it, you gotta love it. But to uh, commemorate that, to go ahead and show a little Alabama pride, I'm gonna do this special. The links below, and um, go ahead, take advantage. Full membership, everything's written below. Because I'm gonna take this time to talk about what's going on with Hustlers Kung Fu. You're gonna see a lot of stuff this year that you've never seen from me. Pretty much some stuff I wanted to do for the last two or three years, just never really came together the way that I wanted it to come together. But now, it's coming together. Now it's shaping up, the vision is clear, and I have the skill sets and the tools to make that vision a reality. A lot of cool stuff is coming, and for those of you who are interested in Freedom School, I went ahead and decided to actually go ahead and put my hands on some stuff to really really do some mentorship to really sit down and guide some people and part of that is freedom school 
big part of that is freedom school because with freedom school I'm going to take people down a journey if you've been a member of the channel you know that I've had a lot of webinars live stuff and that was practice that was practice for the classroom that was practice for things to, to come now if you want to be a member of freedom school and I put it out there you're just gonna to have to do this but go go below this video and you'll see the freedom school criteria because I don't want any candy ass people in freedom school I don't want people who complain and bitch in freedom school I don't want people who are not going to take action in freedom school so with those criteria put in place I know that it's going to knock a lot of people out of the ballpark. I know this. I totally, totally know this. And there are 16 people there right now. Probably by Sunday, there'll be 30. Um, and that's cool. That's cool. Because you will have to follow a prescribed path to get in. It's not like you used to be, because the thing is, um, I got the sponsorship with Audible, that was something that just kind of came out of nowhere. Uh, some other good things happened. So, I have the largest to be real liberal and very, very picky about who's going to be in this school because I'm going to drop the stuff that I do. I'm going to put out the crazy, over the top things. I'm going to put out the training. I'm going to put out screenshots from groups that I'm in. Stuff that just can't be in a big group anyway. Because I've learned a lot in 2015. The goal is to learn even more in 2016. Because that's the thing. You can never stop learning. And you have people who are just stuck on this. I'm going to automate. I'm going to make it simple. It just doesn't last. I'm not going to say it doesn't work. Because it does work. But it doesn't last. And if you're not in that habit of hustling consistently, if you're not in that habit of consistently learning, because I'm gonna just put some out here. You'll see someone, they'll come online, and this is a common thing, and they have this secret recipe. They have this secret formula. And they'll put it out, they'll put together these Facebook groups, they'll put together all these things which are amazing. Now, ask yourself why I'll tell you some that I've said a long time ago and I'm going to say it again when I was in the storage auction business and I had my proprietary system there was no way in hell I would have wrote that first book if I was still in the game no wouldn't have done it wouldn't have done it and then there's this thing online of cooperation that it's not a hundred percent people are not being 100% with what they're really doing. Because if you have this special widget, right? And the special widget makes you a million dollars a month. You're not going to put out a course and sell that widget. You're going to do everything in your power to make that widget as strong and as powerful as it is and try to get up to two million a month and try to get up to three million a month. Or try to get up in four to that's what you're gonna do. That's human nature. That that's that makes sense. So there, there's a lot of stuff that's going on because I was gonna do a podcast last year, and part of a podcast is you gotta bring on guests. And I just was doing a lot of due diligence on people I wanted to bring on to the show. And I saw a lot of stuff that I didn't like. And I saw that I was gonna have to make some associations. I wasn't really happy with so I was like, okay, we're going to scrap this till we come up with a better plan because I don't like how this thing is going. So, podcast is coming sometime this month or the beginning of February. It's going to be really, really different. And then we're going to have some other stuff that's going to kick off. But just to, you know, give you a little taste of what's coming and how it's going to drop, just something for you to think about some for you to put your uh, your teeth in some for you to really really think about because we're in a very wonderful time of year we're in a very 
well, we're in a very special period of time of mankind where someone with no experience can create a business that supports them within six months to 24 months. Consistently, I'm talking about consistent. Like there are programs or things that get you to 10, 15, 20, 30 thousand dollars in a matter of weeks, but you need money to take advantage of them. Let me say that again. You need money to take advantage of them because if you don't have any money, you can't buy the tools and the traffic that you'll need to make the money. I mean, you, you're going to have to have at least 5,000 bucks, at least. And then know the right people, well, 5,000, then you got to pay for the course and pay for the, the relationships and such. So that's really out of the range of uh, Broke Dick Daddy. That's out of the range of, you know, I don't have any money, Mona. It's just out of the range of those people. So just think about what you want your life to look like two years from now. And I know you, you're sitting on this stuff. I don't believe in five-year plans. I don't believe in two-year plans and 10-year plans. And you know, I don't know what the hell is going to happen. My thoughts on that is you have people who are afraid to make a decision and afraid to make a commitment because I had a two-year plan in 2009 and I achieved it in 11 months. If I didn't have that plan, I would have just been, I probably wouldn't be talking to you. I probably would have just gave up on the YouTube channel, just stopped doing this stuff. So this whole notion of not having a plan, not measuring things, not having goals, that is the language of children because you cannot use an atypical event of someone who just, well, I just put this together and in the, in the marketplace loved it and people, that's atypical. Somebody out there right now is going to put together an Instagram, a YouTube channel, a product or something with none of the stuff that I'm talking about and it's going to hit. It's going to hit hard. They're going to make a lot of money. They're going to be on Good Morning America and they're going to say, well, you know, I just followed my passion. But if you go back and reverse engineer what they did, whatever they created, they organically created something that a huge bucket of people liked. That was the secret sauce. So they did the right things. They didn't know why they were doing the right things, but they did the right things. And that's why they're successful, not because of passion. So with that, I'll leave you. Go below, get your Roll Tide special, check out some of the other stuff down there, and I'll see you in the next session.